Hello Divination, in this video I'm going to share with you three beautiful CSS hover effects that you can add to your Divi menu. Because your menu is one of the first things your visitors see when they come to your website, we need to make this menu stylish. So without wasting a lot of time, let me show you how I managed to achieve this. Okay, so before we get started, all the code that I'm going to use in today's tutorial will be provided in the show notes below. Okay, so let's get started and uh, let's add our first style. So I'm going to come over here to theme options and then I'm going to scroll all the way down to the custom CSS. I'm just going to expand this so I can um, add my CSS code. Right, so all we need to do is to paste the CSS code in here like that and then click on save changes. So now let's take a look if our first style has worked. So I'm going to open this in a new tab. And now if I put my mouse over it, you can see we can, we can get a line that's moving across and it is also animating. Pretty cool. Excellent. Okay, so let's move on to the second one. So again, like before, we need to um, add our CSS code right here in the um, CSS um, area. So I'm going to just highlight this code that I just entered for the option one, delete that and then I'm gonna paste the code for option two. So now the reason why we need to delete the first code is it is going to um, conflict. So I'm gonna click on save changes and then we're gonna refresh our page and see what our second one looks like. So we can see we've got a line right below there. Pretty cool. Okay, so let's move on to the third one. Okay, so I'm going to scroll here and highlight the code. Let's delete that and then paste. And then click on save changes. Okay, now we need to refresh the page and see the result. So now we can see that our menus are now stylized and it has a button behind it, which looks pretty cool. Okay, so here's the thing. So the best thing to apply the CSS is to apply to a child theme. And the reason why you want to do that is when Divi uh, has an update, it won't wipe out all your code. So that's one thing I'll recommend that you do. So make sure that you apply this to your uh, child theme. So if you have a child theme installed, the best thing to do is to come here to appearance and then click on editor. And then you click on your style sheet, which is right here. And we can see right here at the top that is the style.css. So this is where you want to add your uh, code. So once you add it here in your child theme, whenever Divi updates, it won't delete your changes. So there you have it. Thank you all for watching. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and do subscribe on our social media channels. By doing so, you'll be notified every time we produce a new video because we are producing these videos on a regular basis. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments box below. Until next time, thanks for watching and see you soon.